Now let's talk about our onion skin. Onion skinning is the ability to uh, view your previous frames or your next frames when animating. This is similar to traditional animation when they needed to in between something or to check consistency with animating uh, a character. So if we were to enable this, just simply hit on the previous frames, hit this button here. And it's currently showing you four drawings beneath this current drawing. You would hit that down arrow to decrease the numbers and you would hit the up button to increase the numbers of drawings that you can see through onion skinning. And there's a button here where you can filter the color of the uh, onion skinning. So let me change the color of the animation here. It's currently like a blue type color here, but I want it to be black. So I adjust my color, make sure it's black there. I will go to layer, change color, and I could choose to either do current frame or all keyframes on layer. So I'm going to do all keyframes on layer. Make sure you have a color set before you change it. Otherwise, it won't change at all. So if I say if I want it blue, then I go up here and try to change it. It won't change since I didn't have a blue color up here yet. So you can also go to the color palette and select the color here. And then here. You can also do that too. All right. Change that back to black. Okay. Oh, that's why I was up here. Sorry. Okay. For onion skinning, I hit that. Now I can look through my frames. And as you can see, my previous drawings in a red filtered color. And I can increase that number if I wanted to. And you can also adjust the opacity of the onion skinning colors by uh, increasing or decreasing on this thing here. As you can see, it gives, it's becoming a more solid red there. And if that's too much of the opacity there, I can just decrease it. All right. You also can see your next frames, and they are indicated with a blue color. And the same as the previous uh, previous frames options, you can also increase or decrease the number of drawings you can view while onion skinning, and you can also change the opacity. Now during playback, let's enable both of these. If I were to play it back, the onion skins won't show because I have unchecked showing during playback. So if I were to check this, and let me turn this back to three. Now if I were to play, it shows my it shows my onion skins doing playback. And I check. Now it doesn't. For the most part, uh, you have your onion skinning. You can control how many drawings you can view at one time with the onion skin enabled. You can also add a filter color to your onion skinning. Currently, it's set a default with red and blue, and they're unchangeable. You can just switch from the current color to the filter color. You can change the opacity. Okay, that's mainly all there is to onion skinning. But that's basically it for this tutorial. Uh, if you enjoyed it, leave a like. And also leave a comment and subscribe if you want more of these or enjoy these particular tutorials. This is DJS Animation 100 signing out. Thanks for watching.